Okay, a unique celebration of glass art is on display, and this is all summer long. That's right. One of the many places to see it is Western Carolina University, and Jennifer Martin takes us inside a special exhibition. From knitted scarves to underwater plant life, you'd be amazed what artists are able to make out of glass. These paper airplanes behind me are formed over steel forms, um, and the imagery on them is screen printed on, so it is all glass. Fifteen of these remarkable creations are on display at Western Carolina University's glass exhibition. They are, you know, really intriguing objects, but they also communicate really interesting messages. Called Glass Catalyst, Littleton's Legacy in Contemporary Sculpture, the show celebrates this piece by Harvey Littleton, who played a major role in the studio glass movement in the 60s. And what we wanted to do was to highlight this wonderful new acquisition that we have at the museum, but also to focus on a younger generation of artists working in glass. This exhibition is actually part of the Summer of Glass, a program across western North Carolina that celebrates the rich history of glass making in this area. Western North Carolina is one of the biggest hubs for glass art in the country. That program was organized in conjunction with the Dale Chihuly exhibition at the Biltmore Estate, drawing from the 100 or so glass artists who live and create in the region. Glass is such a, a fragile and tricky material that I think that's what keeps us artists working in it more and more. In Jackson County, Jennifer Martin, 7 News. That particular exhibition is open Tuesday through Sunday at the university's Bardo Fine Arts Center. It's on display until December 7th. That's right. I love the making of the glass so sculptures, right? And many things that you can see throughout western North Carolina during the summer of glass. And we've got a link on our website with more information.